Most homes have counters covered with papers, refrigerators overflowing with pictures and lists, and bulletin boards filled with messages and schedules. A major part of how people filter and manage this vast amount of communication information is through what we call contextual locations. These are places in the home that have developed specific meanings over time through the household's knowledge of each other's pathways and routines. For example, short handwritten messages are used very frequently in homes. Their location is chosen to make sure the note is seen at the right time, by the right person, near other important information, or to provide awareness or context. Sticky Spots is a location-based messaging system for the home that seeks to extend this natural use of locations. It is designed to allow people to create and place digital notes much like they would paper ones. Sticky Spots allows users to create virtual sticky note messages and to send them to various locations in their home using a network of displays. These displays will be placed in locations important to the household as message centers. They could include existing TVs and PC monitors, along with new displays that could be integrated into the home, such as tablets or ultra mobile PCs. While it is currently cost prohibitive to have so many displays in the home, it is not unreasonable to imagine that a future smart home would have many network displays of all shapes and sizes. Sticky Spots is a virtual message board. It is designed to use pen or touch interaction since it is likely that this will be more practical in the home than a mouse or keyboard. To create a note, touch the note icon. A new note appears and can be written on. Next, you select the location where you want the note to be displayed and hit send. You can have it go to any one or more of the displays connected to the central server. When a new note arrives, it has a light halo around it. Touching a sticky shows when it was sent and where from. Double tapping opens the sticky for adding replies or forwarding to a new location. Notes on the board can be dragged around into any organization and can be easily deleted. You can also send a picture or a web page as a sticky note. Touch the icon, select the image or website, and hit send. The sticky will show up as a thumbnail image or as a web screenshot. Double tapping a web sticky opens the web page. You can select the background color of your sticky along with the color and size of the ink. This allows households to use color in whatever way has meaning to them. Here, for example, all the stickies about an upcoming ski trip are orange. Stickies can also be sent to a specific person rather than, or in addition to, a location. Here Anne is sending Dave a note that she wants him to see when he gets home tomorrow. She knows he usually watches TV first thing when he gets home, so she sends it to the TV. However, just in case he decides to do something else, she also sends it to him personally so that it will show up wherever he is. It turns out that Dave decided to read instead of watch TV. He checks sticky spots and since the note was sent to him personally, he can see it no matter where he is, so he gets the message from Anne. People can sign in to view their personal stickies in two ways, through touch, like Dave, or by swiping an RFID tag, which is small enough to be worn, for instance, on the back of a watch. Personal messages appear on the board in a separate pane. While Sticky Spots is intended primarily for use within the home, it is easy to connect from other locations, such as work, school, or while traveling. This allows, for example, a working mother to send notes to her kids and have them appear where she knows they'll see them. While Sticky Spots is a prototype program, we are currently working on adding extensions such as audio notes or the ability to have your calendar automatically send time reminders to a particular place in your home, such as the entryway, so you see reminders at the right time and in the right place. We would also like to deploy and evaluate Sticky Spots in real households in order to see if it effectively supports people's natural understanding of locations for information.